Yo, what up, y'all? It's your boy Ice Prince of Man. He just touched down Pulse TV. It's about to be live. We're about to get it popping. G Lex, what up? You ready? Let's do this. We out here. Pulse NG just touched down, man. Somewhere in Lekki, Lagos, Nigeria, Africa, worldwide. You know what time it is. We here, man. G Lex, my man, is here with me. Mr. Nale Bishmang is here. Mr. Ishaku is here. Fat boy, sneaker boy in the building, too. Hello! Wow! What's up, man? This is my day one. This is my day one, guys. How are you guys, man? Sorry to barge in just like that. You know, I came to do something. My new album is ready, called Joss to the World. It's my. <laughs> it's. Yes, it's my third album, my third studio album. And it's my first independent album. I, I know you guys already know that Ice Cream is going from Chuck Boy to Super Cool Cat. So this is the first project I will be releasing on the Super Cool Cat. So it's my first independent album. And it's a lot of work for me. This time I don't know we I'll do Paul, this, what's up anymore. It's all me. So it's you know it's a very important project for me and I need you guys to kinda like ride with me somehow. Hi to everybody at Paul. So, so amazing, nice people, beautiful people. And we're going to the chill pill room right now. Cause I'm about to play them some chill, pale music, some good music, some super cool cap music. Ice Prince of Maddie. I have about you guys know through the gods from Empire. She did a verse on the album. And I also have Young L, you know, who's yeah, my, my boy. Um, I have Run Town, I have Timaya, I have Dice, I have Dice on the album too. I have Fino on the album, I have DJ Box. I have Phil Ade. Phil Ade is also a new artist that I need to kind of mention. He's a Nigerian artist who's doing very well overseas. He's signed to Wale's um, um, outfit. It's also on this album, on a song with Sojay and myself. So the whole tape itself is about a, an hour, 15 minutes play. And I obviously, I don't want to keep you guys that long. So I'll just run through the tracks, you know, fast, 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 fast like that. The first record is called Me Vs. Me. And it's a very important song as well on this album for me because this album is going to come out with a book. Hopefully the book comes out in January and also a movie. Now, um, the, 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 the movie is what I'm going to talk about right now. The movie is going to be called Me Vs. Me. And the movie is being written by Benra Jibade and George Kura. You know, but it's an Ice Prince movie, but they're just producing it for me. Basically. I don't know how to produce movies. And the movie is called Me Vs. Me, which is the first track and the intro for the, from this album. Thank you guys. Check this out. Check me versus me out. Uh, I'm blowing trees on Monday. Waiting on my cheese on Sunday. Cause really I was nothing in my young days. Not me. To reality, looking like the mirror on the wall is looking out for me. Cause every time I have a prayer session, I'm talking to a picture that I know in person. Me talking to God, he talking to me. I've been trying to get a cutty, pull up in the Maserati. I've been trying to get a cake, but they're pointing fingers like Mokabi. Niggas talking yaddy yaddy, acting like we buddy buddy, but I don't even know the address. I said, I said, I said. I'm out here popping for real and this in a joke. How I got this far, I got everybody stoked. I'm out here popping for real and this in a joke. Show me the way so I can follow your light. The light shows me everything. Show me the things you only want me to see. Yeah. Hey. Show me the way so I can follow your light. 
That I can't remember last time that I heard your voice Mama can't remember last time that you called my name Yeah That I can't remember last time that I This is why I promise you see, if you hear this song I will cry Because for real I cried recording this I cried recording the song and basically that's a, a, a body a body of what the album feels like and right now my heart is beating very very fast <laughs> The reason why this took so long is because I had to take care of a situation behind the scene. Now I hate to talk about my behind the scene stuff. You know, I leave that for behind the scenes, but this is quite important because I think the fans deserve to know. Um, so my contract with Chocolate City expired in 2013, and that was when I put out my last album. You know what I mean? But we didn't make an announcement about Ice Prince moving on to other things until this year. And you see, in between the whole time, three years trying to, you know, it, we could have easily had a problem with that whole situation and spoiled the Chalk Boy legacy or spoiled everything that we built for years or whatever. You know what I mean? If Ice Prince had left Chocolate City with some sort of fight, as we all know, labels and artists tend to be in Nigeria. You know what I'm saying? And I don't want to be one of those artists that contributes to destroying the label business or you know i'm one of those artists that came under that structure and i don't want to be one of the artists that will come out and i say well, fuck labels or this label what, what now what now what now i still want labels to grow in nigeria as well you know and if i do that my voice is very important a lot of people if i come out now talk to you this label team they see these artists they leave label fight this one that one i stress that one it will, it will kill the label business i believe and that was part of the reason why we had to take almost three years to sort out the behind the scenes quietly I had an awesome time at Pulse TV. The whole fam is family with me right now. I love these people, all good people. You see how I see office. Maybe we just chill. Like, you know? That's how we do at Pulse, baby. Come through the Pulse, you already know what it is. Ice Prince of Manny. Booyah! Yeah.